Let's head to Glenview Park for a Wixa Junior Playoff action. This is the quarterfinal matchup between the Glenview Park Panthers and the Cameron Heights Gales. The Panthers with home field advantage looking to show up in front of the home crowd. The Gales looking to pull out an upset and move on to the semis. Jumping into the first quarter and it's the Gales coming out hot. This is DJ Anambem with the rock for Cameron Heights. DJ picks up a first and then some and the Gales move downfield. The Panthers would turn the ball over, but the Gales defense would answer. Tucker Franchetto gets into the backfield and takes up the runner with a solid tackle. The Panthers were unrelenting, however, and it's Anthony LaRusso going deep to the end zone. Zaya Zacharia's in on the touchdown. And the Panthers take a 7-0 lead after one. Into the second quarter now, the Panthers looking for more. Reed Gillies takes the handoff and he gets down inside the 10. And the Panthers have to punch it in. Here in front of the goal line now, and it's LaRusso stepping up. LaRusso brings us to 14-0 Glenview, and the Panthers would keep coming. Later in the quarter, and it's LaRusso going deep for Chris Brown. Brown brings it down deep in Gale's territory, and the Panthers would finish the drive. It's a short pass from LaRusso to Jacob Fullerton, and Fullerton makes it 21 for the Panthers. The Panthers O producing, and it's the Panthers D shutting it down. It's a big hit in the backfield, and the Panthers would force a turnover. Late in the half now, and it's Anthony LaRusso going back to Zaya Zakaria. Zaya trots it in the end zone, and it's 28 for Preston, heading to the half. Into the third quarter now, and it's the Panthers putting this one to bed. LaRusso spots up Merrick Nahar on the far side. Nahar brings the Panthers to a clean 35, and the Preston Panthers are going to the semis. They take the quarters over the Gales with a final score of 35-0.